or afternoon. Good afternoon. I am so excited to be doing this video. School is back in session for most of you, some of you. Tell me if you are in school. Comment down below if the comments are up. Finding good outfits can be very hard. It's a talent. Just kidding. Anyways, so I thought I would film 10 back to school outfit inspo to give you guys some inspiration on outfits. These are basically just everything I got in my closet. Super easy, super simple. You guys could totally get outfits just like these from just your closet. Before we get on to this video, make sure you guys subscribe down below. Subscribe, 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 please subscribe. Go and check out my jewelry company in the description. It's right in the description. And make sure to subscribe to Clay Leia Vlogs because I have fantastic videos that have been posting on there. So subscribe and let's just get on to the video. Are probably my favoriteest outfit of all times. So you guys probably see me wearing this all the time. I like to wear this over my swimsuit. Like if I'm just in my swimsuit, I'll wear this without a shirt over it. Sometimes I won't put a shirt on, but just wear this for casual. I like to wear this during, especially during the summertime because it's nice and flowy. As you can see, I have spanks on under. This dress is from Red Dress. Literally the cutest company. Go and check them out. I did a collab with them a little bit ago, but it is by far one of my favorites, so go check them out. Um, I really love how flowy it is. I like the top, how it's a v-neck, and then this top right here, it's got like this like tassel on it or whatever you would call it, and it's nice and like elastic-y. And then I love this. I love how it ties right up here. It just is a nice hourglass shape, and it's not too like fancy of a dress. It's like a dress that you could just casually wear, just wherever you want to go. You can also just pair this with like a white t-shirt or some colored t-shirt, or you can wear it without one. I have to wear it with one because of my beliefs, but it's super cute with and without. Yeah. All right guys, this is my outfit number two. Um, super, also super casual. Obviously we got the jeans and just the shirt. See, literally it's such an easy, simple outfit, but the thing I love the most about this is you can see that I have this shoelace for a belt. So instead of tying it all the way around and shoelacing it, I have it just in the back and it's super duper cute. It matches with my shirt. Now, where I live, I couldn't exactly be wearing a long sleeve shirt. I mean, I could some of the days, but it's still very hot. But, I mean, you're in school, you're in a classroom, it's normally freezing cold. I mean, I don't really remember many classrooms that were like nice and warm. They normally made them freezing cold. So, we've got a long sleeve shirt. Um, I love the rips on these jeans. They, and they're super stretchy, super comfortable. But again, super duper simple but still very stylish. And then this white t-shirt, which is also super simple and stylish, but still very cute as you can tell. Yeah, you guys can check out the description down below and you'll see where I bought all of these, but here is outfit number two, another perfect casual outfit, but still very stylish. All right guys, here's outfit number three. We've got ourselves a skirt, of course. This is a cropped pink t-shirt. Actually, yeah, it's cropped. Um, I love how just simple it is. Perfect to pair with literally anything. And then we've got this, this um, skirt with buttons that go all the way down. Now, uh, you can see that they're frayed on the ends. Um, I cut this. This was like down to my legs. And you know, we, we can't do the long skirts. I don't look good in them. A lot of people can pull it off and I'm literally so jealous, but I, on the other hand, can not pull it off, so I cut it. But I love how it looks. Super cute, I love the phrase on the end and it's like the perfect length for me. And yeah, here is outfit number three. next outfit. We've got kind of more of a loungewear style outfit. You can obviously use like black leggings or colored leggings, whichever one works. I've got these purple leggings that are so comfortable. 
We have this simple shirt with these cute little flowers on them. I got this from Brandy at PacSun, but it's from Brandy. Um, and then we got this nice cropped jacket. So it's perfect with this outfit. You could use an oversized jacket as well, but I have got this cropped jacket. Um, literally my favorite part is like the pockets are like up here, so you're like, I'm a pterodactyl or a T-Rex, whatever. Um, and I also love to just zip it up. It's also still pretty cute, like just nice loungewear that you can wear. So yeah, this is my outfit. Number five. Um, this one's again another casual one. I mean, they all basically are casual ones, but this one I've gotten a lot of comments about. Um, these are the army style pants. They have the cuffs on the bottom, the lots of different pockets. I love how they are purple, like cutest color ever. Um, they are just great casual pants to wear. You can pair them with an easy crop top like this or a tight shirt or a fancy shirt. Who knows, you can pair them with anything, but I just love these. They are super duper comfortable, nice to like just wear, and I love pairing them with some either Doc Martens or Nikes or sandals. They honestly can be paired with anything. You can go fancy or you can go casual with this, but I have got these purple pants, and then I have this cute white shirt with a flower in the middle. Very simple, very nice, very cute. Yeah, it's just perfect to pair with this outfit. Um, of course, I've got braids like the rest of the outfits, but here is outfit number five. We got outfit number six. Another dress, of course. This one's a little bit fancier, a little bit more dressy. I really love this right here. It kind of makes it go in more, um, adds a little bit of style to it too, of course. And then I love the tiers it's got basically. This nice little one, and then one right here, and then one down here. Also, the pattern on this is so cute. The pink with the blue and pink flowers on them, super cute. And then we've got this V-neck. Um, and I love how just around it's laced with this lace, basically. I don't know what it's called, but we got this outfit. Super duper cute. I love this outfit. Um, also from Red Dress, just like the other dress. But yeah, you guys go. All right, we have got outfit number seven. Um, this one is very different from the last one. It's not a dress. It's a lot more casual kind of, honestly something I wouldn't see a lot of people wearing at school. But I mean, hey, it's super duper comfortable, super duper cute. I feel like these sweatpants, because they are higher and high-waisted, they've also got a cuff at the end. They are not like super pajama-y. That's, that's a new word now. But it is super stylish and super duper comfortable. I feel like it's something I could definitely wear like, you know, on one of those like days of the month, if you know what I'm talking about. Super comfortable. And then this shirt definitely makes it a little less pajama-y as well, because it's a little bit more fashionable. It is still super casual, but again, I feel like this outfit can definitely be something you can wear to school. I mean, I would definitely wear it to school. I would wear, yeah, this to school. Um, great to like wear a necklace and especially like a necklace that goes down more, kind of accentuate your neck because that's something people want to do. But yeah, here is outfit number six. This one is again another super casual one. Um, I love this t-shirt. This is like probably one of my favorites. I feel like it can be a cute like pajama t-shirt. It's like a baby blue type t-shirt, but I feel like it's in like oldies type shirt. The material on it is just super cool. The fabric, everything is super cute and I love how the buttons go down. Perfect to pair with literally anything. Um, I paired it with these jeans right here. They are a lot more holes in them than the other ones, which I love. I love the jeans with the more holes. And then of course we have got the belt makeshift in the back. Um, also adding a little bit of fancy to it, a little bit of a tail. Yeah, this is another casual one of my outfits. 
And here we go. got outfit number nine almost done with all the outfits this one is another dress up type one actually probably one of my all-time favorites out of all of them I have got this nice pencil skirt right here as you can see it's actually a corduroy super cute and fashionable we've got this nice um, shirt that is cropped I've had this shirt for literally forever but I love the material super loose um, but also still pretty fit so it's nice and tight around and I love it, these stripes that it's got on it. I mean, if I like, yeah, you can't really straighten up these ones, but oh, maybe if I went like this, oh, look at that. Maybe, maybe, whoa, that's weird looking. Okay, well, here is outfit number nine. Okay, you guys, we've got outfit number 10, which is Another dress, of course. This one is also a little bit flowier, and I mean fancier of a dress. It is definitely flowy, as you can see. Look, ready? I am wearing Spanx under it, so don't worry about that. But like, look at this. Um, the florals on this are super cute. I love them for sure. Definitely cute. And then this also right here, which is not something that I tied myself. Like, there's no back part to it, as you can see but it definitely helps with that hourglass shape. And then the skirt is a lot flowier than the top, and so it um, just adds to the look. I love it so much. And it's also kind of like stagger cut, so it's not like cut um, in like a regular even skirt or whatever you call it. You can see how it's kind of like got zigzags and stuff instead of just straight line. And yeah, um, it is a little more see-through. That's the reason I'm wearing a tank top under it. But another super cute dress. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it gave you some inspiration for your back to school outfits. I know it definitely gave me a bunch of inspiration watching some of your videos or some of the other people's videos. So um, I hope you enjoyed this one. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, if you guys wanna check out all the different outfits, I have linked them down below or similar items to the ones that I'm wearing down below. So go and check those out. So maybe twin with me as well. Make sure to comment down below your favorite outfit if you guys can comment. And be sure to subscribe to Clay Lay Vlogs because I am filming some amazing Clay Lay Vlogs over the next three weeks and you guys do not want to miss out on it. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later.